Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're shooting out to have a look and see if we can get some sunset photos at the beach uh, using Trig Beach again. Some great area around there that I can test out. I'm going down early and we're gonna see what we can do. There's not as much cloud as I'd like for that sun to bounce off. Uh, it was supposed to have some, but I've got an hour and a half before it comes, so we'll see what happens. minute drive there's obviously afternoon traffic everyone's getting trying to get home so it might be a little bit busier so it won't be too bad the clouds have seemed to thin but there seems to be some ahead near the beach i've got an hour and a half so fingers crossed we do get something that'll let some refraction come off um, that's always good in the scene to have that cloud and get that sun rays sort of hiding behind it or whatever or bouncing off and give those nice deep oranges um, I have had some luck here. We've done a sunrise at Trig Beach and had a bit of luck. Not as much as I hoped, but it was uh, still pretty good. And hopefully today we have a bit of luck. Right, yeah, I'm going to be sh shooting with the 1DS Mark II today. Also, obviously the M50. Um, I've got most lenses. We've got the 10 to 18 as well there. And I've also got the 55 to 200 if I want to do some sort of panorama or something if I need to turn around or change avenues or if I find some bird or animal life or fish life or waves or anything like that. I haven't looked at the waves or anything like that. Um, that'll be a bonus if there's something uh, out there with that. The, the foreground generally at that area is pretty amazing so I shouldn't have too much drama finding a composition to use. So. There we go. Obviously sunsets, ND filters, uh, filters. I've just got my new Siri 1000 ND filters arrived this week. So that's good, I've got that. If it gets a little bit too bright and intense and I need to slow it down, I want to slow down that water. So that should be really good. Um, I use their variable filter and it does a really great job. So it's really good uh, ND system. So. Let's see how we go. Rightio, we'll talk to you more when we get to the beach because it looks like traffic has just started piling up.
Yeah, you should be able to hear me. <laughs> so there's the end of the sunset. I got here a little bit. Oh, I got here in time. I just so much to pick and choose. So struggled to find a spot. But uh, no, I did well. So ended up shooting down here. Not sure if you can see the camera there. Yeah, so come up pretty good. I covered, got a few shots. I was trying to focus, stack it a fair bit and see what I could find. Okay, so I think I did pretty well. Um, thought I'd give myself plenty of time, but I had to rush in the end to try and get something. It, uh, the sun doesn't take long to go down and there's heaps of good spot. Heaps of nice moss on all these rocks here in this area and you can see all that. It's pretty darn cool. Very, very nice. Waves coming in. <laughs> now, while I get a bit of light lesson, I'm gonna try and shoot a bit of wave stuff. There's a few decent waves and I wanna get some coastline while I've still got that golden hour. And yeah, I'll talk to you again soon. So, just moving spot now, and of beautiful orange on that. Coming across now over the coastline. How good is that? Just found another composition I'm gonna try of taking a few shots and it's come up really really nice just put that bag down there so you can come over I'm not sure if you can I can show you you might not be able to see it in there it's a little, getting a little bit dark for the video camera but the photos look really good really good that bright green of the moss is just popping so i want to try and get a few more of that and uh, flip this around low light and test for the video camera too not too bad it's like reasonably dark uh it'd be better with the 
M40 obviously, but uh, I'm still pretty happy with it. It's quite handy, I can still shoot and do that. I guess once I get the new M1, M50, I can retire this. But uh, yeah, until then, this is going really well. I'm gonna keep shooting, get some more, and I'll talk to you back when I get in the car. Hey guys, uh, well that was pretty cool. I'm pretty happy with how that went. Uh, got some nice photos. The second composition was really, really cool. I think that did really well. I'm pretty happy with how that went. Uh, the first one, maybe, I had to rush really quick and I was trying to shoot with two cameras. So I was running and gunning with the 1DS and then I had this one doing the long exposure, trying to get that smooth water. Had the new brand new Siri 1000 ND filter on there that arrived this week to replace the old one that I broke. Uh, so that's pretty cool. Um, and I some really good photos in, in regards to that. I think I was pretty happy with that, how that went. Other than that, um, we'll find out when I get home. So the, the mo that green moss that was growing on the rocks was just amazing. That was popping out. Very, very cool. Okay, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for stopping by. Hit the subscribe and like. Share it around. Let everyone know and catch up here on another day, another vlog. Or if you're podcasting, catch on another day, another pod. Anyway, thanks for stopping by. Catch you soon on the next feed. Peace.